Hi guys, uh, Death Fight 44 here. Um, today's video. Sorry, I haven't made a video in a while on RuneScape. It's just that I've been playing a new game called Perfect World. It's a really fun game. Um, but yeah, that's why I haven't been making a new video. Um, more videos lately. Um, but anyway, I'm doing one now, and this is the one on the Warriors Guild. You need to have. To enter the Warriors, you have to be a member, and your attack and strength levels have to add up to 30 or more. Mine are at that level, so I can enter. But how to get here? Um, you can walk here, but I really, I really don't suggest it. But anyway, you can get a games necklace uh, from the Grand Exchange, and you want to rub it, waste charge, and go to Birthrop's Games Rooms, and this is it right here this castle thing and you just want to go up the steps closest to you and you'll come out here and you just want to come out and then directly north and here you are so here you go so you get in here and you want to enter this, uh, first of all, there's a bank over here where you can get some food or whatever you need. Um, what you do need is you have to have um, any type of armor set. Uh, it can be like bronze, uh, bronze, iron, steel, mithril, black, uh, and rune, and adamant. Um, they all vary in levels. But you have to, you must have, this is a must, you must have a full helm, a plate leg, and a plate body. Um, they are both, their levels vary. See, there's this guy, Mr. Armor is 92, which is the one I'm going to be fighting. Um, Mr. is 113, and they all vary between the uh, the levels. The one thing that you're after, though, is these things. Warrior Guild Tokens. That's how you're going to get your um, defenders in the long run. Um, but anyway, let's begin. So what you want to do is you want to select any of the armor and use it on these magical animators. Once you've done that, uh, these things will come alive, and then you just want to attack them. Um, yeah, these guys, they drop 25 of them. 25. And I recommend to get a rune. If you're after the rune defender, I would suggest, like, 1 to 2k. But I only have 130, because I already got some of the defenders. Um, so basically, once you kill them, you do this for quite a bit. Until you've got the 1 to 2k or however your desired amount would be. So as they do that, they'll drop the armor again. And after you want these, see, 155 from 130. Once you've got 1 to 2k of those, you can come out. Come out. And you can get some food yet again if you're here. If you want to get the 1 to 2k, get food on. Um, but yes, yeah, so once you got those, go up the staircase and go up again to the top floor and you'll come up here. Now, the guys in here will, are a level 56 cyclops, cyclopses and 72, I believe, 72 cy level cyclopses. So what you want to do is you want to talk to her, um... Just talk to her, and then you can just say bye, but anyway. And then you want to open the door. Okay, anyways, but um, I don't have the defender on that I need, so um, just one sec. Okay, so now that I've got my defender, um, you won't need a defender when you first enter because you have to get the bronze one, but once you do... When you first enter, and you have your bronze one, you've got these things, and it's a random drop that 
they will get they will give you a defender. It takes ten tokens to get in, and as you see, fifty six. Uh, real easy to kill. They have a low defense or and high HP. Um, the max they've hit on me has been seven, and I don't have a very good def uh, defense rate um, level rather. But yeah, so you just want to kill them. And it's actually a pretty decent place for prayer, but every minute, ten of your tokens crumbles away. And they drop a whole bunch of this random junk, but some stuff, if you have it in mass quantities, can add up to a lot. But besides the fact, so you just want to come in here, and as soon as you've gotten a defender, um, you want to... Here, one sec. Um... Yeah, this is pretty. It, after you run out of tokens, you can actually stay in the arena and train. And it's, it's okay. Well, I, I haven't spent likely times in this. I've just wanted to get the defenders, but it's. I think it's pretty decent training because they don't hit high at all if you have a high defense. So basically, yeah, they'll auto retaliate. Um, but anyway, once you get your defer first defender, or you need to get food, you want to come out here. And if you do have a defender that you've just gotten, you can come out here and then come back in, and she'll say, um, good, you've gotten a defender. Now, instead of getting a bronze one, you get iron. Instead of iron, you get steel, and so on. And it took me, I don't know how long it took, but it took a... Uh, I got like a thousand or something or five hundred. It took me like five hundred um, tokens just to get um, a bronze one. Then I logged out, um, and then next time I logged in, the first kill I got, I got an iron defender. So it really is depending on how. It just depends how many tokens you have, and after you ran out of tokens, you have to have at least three hundred or sorry, uh, one hundred to get in. So, um, that's the Warriors Guild, and how do you get a Rune Defender? Um, because I downloaded Perfect World, I'm probably going to be playing that a little more than I am going to play RuneScape. I'll be I'll, um, making more videos every maybe one, two days, maybe more on the weekend. I don't know, because uh, Perfect World's pretty fun, and it's an awesome game. Um, if you want to go check it out, uh, it's a big file, two gigabytes, but it's really worth it. Um... So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and comment, rate, subscribe.